Thank you for joining me today. My name is Emily. I am a nurse in Japan and also a registered nurse in Australia. I'm going to take you through today's session. We are going to learn how to respond effectively to behavior of concern. Before we begin the session, let's make sure that you are nice and comfortable to start the class. This class will consist of two sessions and each class will take about 10 to 15 minutes. Let's start part one. Today, we are going to learn about dementia. More specific, we are going to learn how to respond effectively to behavior of concern. I will try my best to give enough examples. I hope you can pick something new from this session. Let's start with a question. Have you ever heard of the word dementia before? Do you have any thoughts on this? I believe everyone knows what dementia is and has a rough idea of what dementia is. How about next question? What is the first thing coming up to you when you hear dementia? I assume people have a different opinion on this. Some might be expert on this and others don't. We will learn the outline of dementia today. Let's look at some statistics first. It is data from 2022, Australian government website. Over the age of 65, dementia affects almost one person in 10. I believe it is quite a large number. If you have a big family who are over 65, for example, grandpa or grandma, some of them might have dementia. Almost 1.6 million people are involved in the care. We cannot ignore this fact. There is a large number of people who are involved in the care, not only family members, but also healthcare staff, such as nurses and doctors. As healthcare professionals, we will take care of people with dementia every day. So it is important to have the skills and knowledge to respond to them effectively. Learning outcome? We have one learning outcome today. At the end of the session, you'll be able to identify one behavior of concern. What we will cover today? Knowledge of dementia, type of behavior of concern. Let's move on to the contents. What is dementia? Dementia is a general term for loss of cognitive function, such as thinking, remembering, and reasoning. I am just showing you a picture. As you can see, dementia is a general term for loss of memory and cognitive skills, which is severely interfere with daily lives. Under the umbrella on the right side, there are common causes of dementia. There is Alzheimer's disease and vascular dementia, for example. The most common cause of dementia is Alzheimer's disease. Now we look at symptoms. 